you're in your 50s and you're thinking about finding love again. You might have come out of a long-term relationship, divorced, widowed, or widower. And you, gosh, you just don't know where to turn, what to do. You've been out of the dating scene for maybe one, two, three decades. And your friends, your friends might still be married. So they don't know what to tell you. You don't want to ask your coworkers. And you certainly don't want to turn to your children for help. Well, let me tell you something. You can find love again. And my name is Maria Romano, and I am a dating coach and minister in Las Vegas, Nevada. And I focus on people just like you that are looking to find love again. That's right. No matter what age you are, my focus is 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, and beyond. And you can find love again. And I know it can be a little difficult. I've been there too, just like you. I was married to the love of my life for over three and a half decades, and I didn't know what to do, and I didn't know where to turn, and that's why I developed my course of going from just one to a plus one, and if you're interested in learning more about that, please click the link that I have below. It's www.truelovenots.com. However, today what I'm going to give you is three tips that you can utilize immediately so you can launch yourself in the dating world. The first thing you need to do is you need to think about the type of partner that you're looking for. Because the partner that you're looking for one, two, three decades ago is different than what you're looking for today. You've evolved through the years, right? Before, you might have raised children with somebody. You might have set up house. Now you're at a point in life where you might be looking for somebody that's a travel partner or friend, someone to just enjoy life with, but also can blend in with your family. So that's something to think about is the type of person you're looking for. And are you looking for somebody that's a travel partner or a friend? Are you looking for a long-term relationship? And that long-term relationship is also known as LTR. That's right. I'm going to give you some acronyms too that you can utilize because you've been out of the dating world for a while. So now you're thinking, okay, I'm going to think about the type of person I want, but where do I go from here? Well, one of the things you can do is you can launch yourself online. That's right. And I know you might be a little hesitant. And I have an entire course that helps someone like you launch themselves online. But I'm going to give you a quick little synopsis of what you can do right now. Is just look and see the different dating apps that are out there. Choose one that's right for you. And make sure you have some great pictures and write a profile that highlights you. And just go have fun. And the third thing, remember, it's just dating. That's right, just dating. So before you decide to go out and meet somebody, make sure, number one, that you meet in a safe place and that you're comfortable. And make sure you have a phone call with them beforehand. And don't have a journalistic approach when you meet them. Just relax and enjoy it because it's dating. And that's what dating is all about. So that when you get out there in the dating world and when you meet somebody, you're able to go from just one to a plus one. Now, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you want to learn more and you want to have the proper tools and you want to be well-versed in dating, contact me. I want to make my long journey your shortcut to happiness.